I've had these vest inserts sitting around for a while and uh, apparently they were used quite commonly in wartime conflicts 10 or 20 years ago for crewmen. They're called CVC. They apparently are for fragmentation. But my question is a simple one. These things are available online. I got them very cheaply years ago. And this thing's essentially in perfect condition. Apparently they put two of them in a front and back position in a vest for fragmentation only. But my question is, seeing as they're so readily available and relatively inexpensive, my question is simple. Do they serve as a protective value at all, even from small caliber bullets? So I'm going to shoot this thing with a 22 caliber at short range, just a handgun, just to see to what extent it does anything. It's just sitting up against this stump here, and we'll see whether it penetrates, doesn't penetrate, or anything. I think I was reading there are about seven layers of Kevlar thick, and are meant to be used, as I said, with two in front and two in back. So this is not scientific at all, it's just kind of a curiosity thing I have. We'll see how it does. So it looks like it actually didn't defeat this round. It's only a 710 frame per second round, so it's not very fast. It just bounced off the vest. Let's see if I can find it. This was a quiet CCI round, so it's very slow. But it didn't defeat it. It didn't go through the back of one of the layers of these panels. interesting. Another interesting thing is just playing around with this vest I realized the round was actually trapped in between the layers and by feeding it up I got the round to actually present itself. This is just a regular lead bullet. It's not even jacketed or sprayed with copper so it's a particularly easy round to defeat. But nevertheless interesting that this little cheapy seven layer Kevlar vest defeated a relatively low velocity 22. I wouldn't trust this thing to protect me versus a real bullet, but interesting that it at least defeated this little guy.